What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and today I'm going to talk to you about how your pro shop operator can help you increase your average this league season. Now that the 2024-2025 league season is upon us, there are things that you can go to your pro shop operator for to help your average go up 5, 10, 15 pins this season and I'm going to show you guys what those things are. Now the first and most important thing that I like to stress uh, before every league season is coming in and rechecking your fit. You want to be doing this at the very least probably every year because your hand is going to change whether you're a younger kid getting older, your hands getting bigger, or if you're someone who's a little bit older maybe your flexibility is changing a little bit and that could be causing you to squeeze the ball without you even knowing it. Because as we're bowling throughout the league season, a year, two years, three years, don't get refit, uh, your hand is going to subconsciously just adjust to the ball that you have. So you're gonna be uh, squeezing or creating pressure in maybe some spots that you don't really want to. So you're gonna wanna just go into your pro shop and have them just look at your fit, see if there's anything weird going on, see if the flexibility's changed, maybe your getting a callus in a spot where you didn't used to maybe two years ago, three years ago. And that could just be your, your hands changing, your hands needing something a little bit different, whether it be the shape of the oval, whether it be your span, whether it be pitches, it could be a myriad of things. But I definitely recommend you going in and making sure your fit is correct. And I also would probably recommend if you're not totally satisfied with your fit, just go check out some other pro shops. Different pro shop operators will probably have different philosophies and you just have to find the one that works for you. But definitely do your due diligence in trying to find the perfect fit for you because that is one major factor that a lot of people don't take into consideration. And it's probably one of the biggest things that I stress, especially as a pro shop operator, but just as a bowler in general, not having to worry about what my hand is feeling, how the ball feels in my hand. That's just another big factor that I don't wanna to have to worry about when I'm competing, especially if I'm bowling tournaments, competing at the highest level. I don't wanna be giving that handicap to anybody, all right? So make sure your ball is fitting perfectly just for you so you have the confidence to go throw it and go throw a lot of strikes. But here's the next tip. The next thing you want to be doing after you make sure your ball is fitting absolutely perfect for you is to make sure that your balls are being laid out perfectly for you. So go into your local pro shop and just go see and ask if you can get your PAP. What a PAP is, for those of you that don't know, it's your positive axis point. It is the point on the ball at release. It pretty much tells the pro shop operator how you throw the ball and more importantly, where to put the pin, the mass bias if it's an asymmetrical bowling ball, and the pin buffer for uh, pin buffer layout users, dual angle users. It's imperative that you have your PAP so your balls are laid out properly so they're doing exactly what you want them to do. A lot of pro shop operators, they'll just put this standard layout on a bowling ball for most people, but if you are serious about your game, you really wanna be the best that you possibly could be, go to your pro shop operator, and ask for them to come out, watch you throw a couple, get your PAP so they can lay out the ball properly and after seeing you throw some, they know about how fast you throw, what your rev rate's like, what your tilt looks like, how you like to play the game. And from there, a good pro shop operator will be able to curate a certain bowling ball with a certain layout just for you. That'll work wonders for you. And that can be the difference between carrying the extra 10 pin, carrying the extra seven pin, your ball working for an extra half, maybe a whole game throughout the transition, having a ball laid out perfectly for you is gonna help you create optimum entry angle into the pocket and help you throw more strikes. Now on top of that, the next thing that your pro shop operator can do for you is they can help you choose the right bowling ball for your game and for where you're bowling. Obviously bowling centers all vary with different lane surfaces, different climates, temperatures, humidities, uh, a variety of different factors. So it's important that you have a pro shop operator that knows about these things and knows about your game and knows what kind of balls are gonna match all those factors for you specifically that's gonna help you throw the most amount of strikes. Now, why that's important and 
the important thing to know is that it's not gonna be the same thing for everybody. Someone who is a little bit higher rev rate, like myself, is gonna require a certain set of bowling balls, uh, which are gonna be different to someone who maybe is a little bit lower rev rate, likes to throw a little bit harder. We're gonna play different parts of the lane. So bowling balls, layouts, things like that are gonna be different between that bowler and a bowler like myself. There are thousands and thousands and thousands of different style bowlers out there. So the combination is endless. So making sure you're getting that right bowling ball for your play style, for how you like to play the lanes, getting those laid out properly to your PAP is gonna be imperative. And it may be the easiest way that you can increase your average and throw that extra strike per game. Because if you're throwing one more strike per game, that is at least 10 pins up on your average. If you're throwing a couple, maybe you're going up 20 pins, but that is so important. That is something that you don't even have to work on in your game. You don't have to go and practice to get these extra pins. It's just going to your pro shop operator, making sure you're going to the right pro shop operator for you and making sure you're getting these things correct. That is gonna help you increase your average. Now here are some other things that are gonna help you increase that average as well. Some of the simpler things that you can do to help increase your average, one, is making sure your surfaces are tip top shape. Every week that you bowl, your ball is going to try and get to the same surface as the lane. So if you're not refreshing the surface on a bowling ball every time you go bowl league, or you're just neglecting it for a whole league season, you're not gonna have the same performances when you started that league season to the end of the league season. Especially if you're one who's throwing one of the super strong cover dull bowling balls, those balls seem to be affected the most by just going down the lane. They're, you'll notice that it's not going to end up dull after the end of the league season. It's going to get a little bit of lane shine. So you're going to lose a lot of that grit and that grip, a lot of that performance that you were expecting when you first got the ball. So it's very important that maybe you carry around some Avalon pads with you. You can touch up the surface yourself or just go into your pro shop guy and say, hey, can you bring this back to box? Maybe you do that every week, maybe you do it once every three weeks, whatever you like. But just know that to get the same performance that you were expecting when you first got the bowling ball, you have to do some upkeep on the surface of the bowling ball. Same thing applies with the shiny balls as well. You can have the pro shop operator, again, take this back to box, get a little bit of new surface under that polish, and there you go, you're gonna have that brand new performance. But here is the last thing that a pro shop operator can do for you to help increase your average. Now, the last thing that a pro shop operator can do to help you increase your average, it's, it probably sounds a little bit silly. It probably doesn't even sound like it can increase your average, but I wholeheartedly believe it can. And that is, if you are someone who uses grips, get those changed. You want to be changing your grips. If you want the most consistent, like new feel, you're probably gonna to wanna to change them every 20, 25, 30 games or so, which is, what is that? Every seven, eight, nine, 10 weeks of league, if you're rolling a three game league, you're gonna to wanna to get those changed. And why that's important is they're just made of rubber. So you're gonna lose a little bit of texture as you keep bowling. They may stretch, they're gonna wear out. So you're gonna to wanna to get those changed. You can get away with changing them probably once every league season, honestly. But if you're very serious about your game, if you bowl leagues, tournaments, you're trying to make the big bucks out there, you're trying to be the best that you possibly can be, you're gonna wanna be changing these out pretty consistently because there's just nothing like that like new feel of a new set of grips. So you're gonna wanna be doing that to get the best feel that you possibly can. Because again, like I said about the fit, you don't wanna be worrying about oh, my grips are a little too big, they're a little worn, they're not feeling the way I want them to feel. If you're worrying about that while you are bowling, it is going to affect your shot making and that's not gonna help your average go up. So please go into your pro shop guy or girl and get those grips changed. And that is it guys, that's all I've got for you. Those are some ways that your local pro shop operator can help you increase your average. Because who doesn't want to get to a 220, 230, 240 average? These are some simple ways without practicing that you can get up there. That is something that your pro shop operator can do, your local professional. And if they're not, go to a different pro shop operator. Maybe come take a visit to TV Bowling and Supply. We can get you figured out. I would love to help every single one of you guys out. You guys know where we are, Columbus, Ohio. But if not, if that's too far, just find your local pro shop guy. 
hopefully he's good. He should be able to do all these things for you. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful for you. I hope for everyone to increase their average at least 10 pins this season, because why wouldn't we want that? But please hit that like, comment, and subscribe button. We are very on our way to 40,000 subscribers. We are on our jolly way there. We want to get there. When we get there, we do what we always do. We're going to give away a bowling ball, Storm, Rotor Grip, 900 Global, ball of choice to one of you lucky subscribers. So please hit that like, comment, and subscribe button. Tell your friends, tell your family, subscribe as well. And I'll see you guys in the next video.